Hey everybody, my name is Aisha Tyler and welcome to the Ubisoft E3 Media Briefing. I am super excited to be here and I hope you are too. This is my third time hosting the Ubisoft Presser and I'm incredibly happy to be back. And someone actually asked me recently, why do I keep doing these pressers when the internet is so full of bullshit? And I told them <laughs> it's because I love video games. I love everything about them. I love playing them. I love watching other people play them, not as much as I love playing them, but I love them. And just like all of you guys watching right now, I can't wait to find out what awesome stuff is coming next. Well, I can tell you right now, I have seen what's coming next, and this show is going to be amazing. It is exciting, it is terrifying, it's uplifting, it's even gonna get a little sweaty, it's hella fucking smoky, apparently it's 420 in this bitch. <laughs> Everybody clapping is in the back of the theater because they were late. Today's briefing perfectly encapsulates all the killer stuff that Ubisoft does. Ubisoft's development teams across the world continue to generate insanely cool things, creating not just compelitive, compelitive or compelling, that was two words together, compelling interactive narratives, but sprawling immense worlds. Worlds that surprise us, worlds that challenge us, worlds brimming with opportunities for us to dive into the action. Worlds that just reek of awesome. And speaking of which, I'm really hoping you guys have all had a chance to hack and weaponize Chicago and Watch Dogs by now. Everybody played it? Sweet. Sweet. I have to tell you, I was incredibly stoked to be asked to be part of that game. Uh, it, it's a gamer's dream come true to see your voice coming out of your screen and then get to roll over yourself in a dump truck. Um, or hug yourself or teabag yourself, whatever you're into. But. I was not asked to be in this next game, and I'm totally okay with that, because while I have many talents, uh, I got star throwing skills, I got nunchuck skills, uh, dancing is not one of my skills, unlike most of my people. But luckily, no matter how much you suck at dancing, there's plenty to love about Just Dance 2015. Just Dance is a franchise that belongs to its fans, and since 2009, 100 million players have interacted with the Just Dance universe, creating, sharing, and being at the center of that experience. Just Dance 2015 not only features an updated track list with artists like Pharrell Williams, I know you're not sick of that song yet, and Ellie Goulding, but for the first time, the passion and engagement of the community, the gaming community, is gonna help power the game itself. So, let's take a look at what's coming. Kevin Bacon in Footloose, the real Footloose, not the lame remake, Just Dance is always finding new ways to bring people together with dance. And in that spirit, the team is introducing a brand new way to break out of your living room and further deliver on the promise that everyone and anyone can dance, including a freakishly tall, klutzy, yet slightly masculine girl like me. Here to tell us more is Just Dance's executive producer, Mr. Jason Altman. Thanks, Aisha. Hi everyone, I'm here to introduce 
Just Dance Now, a completely new way to play the game with anyone, anywhere, and at any time. All you need is a smartphone and an internet-connected big screen, like a tablet, a PC, or a smart TV. It doesn't matter what kind of smartphone you have, or even if you're all on different connections, Wi-Fi, 3G, 4G, everyone will be in sync, playing together in real time. This isn't just a breakthrough for Just Dance. This is a breakthrough in latency-free, multi-device online gaming. Let me show you how it works. I've downloaded the free app to my phone. On my connected big screen, I go to JustDanceNow.com. It detects my smartphone, lets me join the dance room, and we're playing Just Dance. As usual, when I play Just Dance, I follow the dancer on screen and use a controller to dance. Only now, the controller is my phone. Just Dance has always been about a small group of players having fun together at a living room or at a party. The magic of Just Dance now is that there's no limit to the number of people who can play. From four people, to 20 people at a birthday party, to the 2,000 people in this auditorium, to 20,000 people at a stadium concert. Anyone with a smartphone who can see that big screen can join the game, bringing us one step closer to connecting the world through dance. Let's play. Alberta. Give it up for Alberta, everybody. Uh, that was awesome. Uh, that was incredibly, and, and, uh, and then I think an honorable mention goes to Jason. No, it was, a, it was a E for effort, my thank friend. Thank you very much. Yes. Thank you. Thanks, Give it everybody. up for Jason Have Altman, a good show. everybody.